Tommy Drunette feared the worst when his daughter, 41-year-old Tamika Stewart, disappeared April 14th. It was going to be bad. She wasn't, she wasn't coming home. Then April 17th, detectives found Tamika's body in the trunk of her car near 29th and Glendale. And they said she was stabbed over and over and over and over. 49 times, according to a criminal complaint against Tamika's husband, 41-year-old Gerard Stewart. He's now charged with first-degree reckless homicide in her death. Prosecutors tying him to Tamika's death using surveillance video and a GPS tracking device he was required to wear from a domestic violence case in January. The victim, Tamika. The charges, strangulation, intimidation, and false imprisonment. Gerard Stewart posted $5,000 cash bond less than a month later. I think she knew that she was in a deadly situation because she had told several members that she was going to die. Days after the January incident, Tamika filed a restraining order against Gerard, writing, quote, I'm scared that one day he might actually kill me, and that leaves my kids without their mother, just like I don't have mine. We got to learn from this. this. My daughter is fine. You know, she don't have to run for her life anymore. She don't have to be running from knives and trying to protect her kids. Erica Finke joins us now live in the newsroom tonight. Erica, Gerard Stewart is in custody right now. In custody, but not in Milwaukee. Detectives interviewed him April 18th at a Minneapolis jail. Online records show he's still there tonight. It's not clear when he'll be brought back to Milwaukee.